Have you ever wondered why there are two accounts of creation? If you noticed, there are slight differences between the first account of creation and the second one. Today, I bring you the story of Lilith. There is a possibility that you've never heard of this name. Don't worry, I got you. Before God created Eve, he had made a woman for Adam by the name Lilith. However, things didn't work out for them and that's when God resolved to create another woman for Adam by the name Eve. If you remember very well, the biblical creation story, you'll know that man was created on the sixth day and on the seventh day, God rested. Now, the biblical narration asserts that the woman was made from a man's rib, or rather, Adam's rib, which is absolutely true. But drawing back before the creation of Eve, God had created another woman by the name Lilith, and he made her to be Adam's wife. Unlike Eve, Lil was made, Lilith was made from the same dust that was used to create Adam, and so they had the same strength, physique, and power. Due to this, they often argued over who should be the head of the family. In some of the creation stories, it's asserted that Adam and Lilith often argued regarding who should be on the dominant position during sex. <laughs> Lilith wanted to be on the top, but Adam could not let her. Let me take you back a little bit. If you read the story of creation in Genesis, you'll notice that there are two accounts of this story. These two stories are slightly different. In the first account, which can be found in Genesis chapter 1 verse 27, it says that God created man and woman at the same time and both of them in his own image. However, in chapter 2, God creates Adam first out of dust and then makes Eve out of Adam's ribs. Majority of Christians consider these stories to be the same story. And they only consider the second one to be an advanced version of the first story. However, according to traditional Judaism stories, it is believed that the story in Genesis chapter 1 and 2 are accounts of different women. The first being the story of Lilith, while the second one is the one that you know, the story of Eve. There is a possibility that the editors of the Bible did not want to portray the demonic part of Lilith. And that's why they opted to omit it. Now let's continue from where we had left. Lilith's unwillingness to take the inferior position led her to quit their marriage and run. She flew away to the Red Sea upon realizing that Adam will never consider her to be equal regardless of the fact that they had been created equally from the same material. After running away, she turned into a demon and started to give birth to demonic children every single day one day god sent angels to capture her and bring her back to adam she was even threatened that if she didn't go back to be with adam she will lose a hundred of her demonic children however lilith was so furious but preferred losing her children than going back to be with adam since then she became eve eve's biggest rival and started killing his children and the generations that followed. For such and many more stories, subscribe to our channel. Don't forget to click the bell icon so that you can become the first to know when we have a new story for you. Thank you.